Great and wonderful people, how on our day, welcome back to Tessie's TV. We don't carry another approval come on a domot about waiting the sub for inside palace. As information where the wishes allegedly be said that KBAC Oba Adeyeye was shocked as thunder strike almost by Olori Mariam with her babalawo for inside palace. This one is a shocking news to KBAC because KBAC did not know that Olori Mariam, she came into the palace with her babalawo behind Queen Naomi's royal manor. This is where we heard that this thing happened. Nobody knew how they entered. But as they were doing incantations, they were doing the undurable before the thunder strike now scattered everything. We heard that the rain did not fall. The weather did not change. But thunder really striked. Then God say she wasn't hot because if this thunder gets her, she might not be alive by now. The Oloris has refused to keep quiet. They have refused to come out their hand for Queen Naomi head. They, I don't know why they are so obsessed with Queen Naomi Shinekola Okunsi. That Kabi Ezi told you people that he loved Queen Naomi so dearly. He married Queen Naomi because of the love he have where Queen Naomi is. Is not the reason why the Oloris should be so desperate to chase Queen Naomi out of the palace. Because as you are fighting Queen Naomi, it is making Kabi Ezi to love him, to love her more and more. That is just the truth. If they keep fighting Mommy Tedini Kabo, Kabi Ezi will keep loving Queen Naomi. You cannot stop the love that Kabi Ezi have for Queen Naomi. If Kabi Ezi love you, Kabi Ezi will come for you. But to show that they force themselves into the palace, Kabi Ezi is not paying attention to them. So today, Olori Maria, she is getting serious katakata with Kabi Ezi because Kabi Ezi is already terminated to leave palace, to go back to Ebira, to go back to Baba Nasiru. Because he is not ready to welcome her back in the palace as his wife after what she did to Prince Tedinikau. It was a terrible accident, but thank God Prince Tedinikau survived. And you still want Kabiesi to marry you. So as Kabiesi is still getting issues with Olori Maria, Olori Maria is fighting. Queen Naomi saying that Queen Naomi is the reason why KBSC wants her out of the palace. That Mami Tsedinekawo is the main koko. Why KBSC won't push her come out for palace? Say, if Queen Naomi is not the reason that KBSC no go push her come out. And for that, that Queen Naomi no go rest for her. That she did radio to fight Queen Naomi spiritually, physically. She cannot allow Queen Naomi to enter palace. Remember, there was something happened yesterday. Something very terrible happened. Yes. Over uh, the dead bats that was sighted in Queen Naomi's apartment, inside Queen Naomi's room, and Kabyas has not rested. Kabyas vowed to find out who and who is responsible and brought them to book. That anybody that tries Queen Naomi and Prince Tedinika will spiritually will be dealt with. So Kabiesi is still fighting to find out the truth. Yesterday Kabiesi was in Ifa Shrine till midnight. Uh, they were doing incantations, they were asking questions, they were begging the gods to speak. And we heard that Kabiesi keeps on getting warning from the gods that they have warned him to send the Oloris out. They don't want them in the palace. They are polluting the palace. And today again, Olori Miriam has entered with her babalawo to come and pollute the palace again, saying that she has come to scatter the palace. She has come to destroy Queen Naomi. She will not enter palace. Or she will be Olori Miriam. No go sit down like this. Queen Naomi will come into the palace and demote her. 
But you came into the palace and pursued Queen Naomi. You don't want Queen Naomi to return back and demote you to second position. And because of that, you carry Babalawo into Kabi's palace. My correct and wonderful people. I beg, make a great to now before we carry this our Africa. They go. Good morning, afternoon, evening to you all according to your time. And the time we will take the see this video. You are welcome back to Texas TV, and we are still on the gist about waiting the sub for inside palace. My correct and wonderful fans. When I see all of Miriam, one day she go see waiting she define for Queen Naomi body for that palace. She will not be spared on that day. Tengo said the gods are still fighting for Queen Naomi. Because this thunder strike will happen. No be ordinary thunder strike, but some people no go understand waiting the sub. That it is a spiritual and not physical battle. She was at the backyard of the royal manor where Queen Naomi locked up because Queen Naomi is not in the royal manor now. So she locked the royal manor up. Kabi is handed over the key to Queen Naomi. Queen Naomi was with the key and she it is in a Akira mansion where Queen Naomi is now. And she came in the afternoon when nobody is in the palace. Maybe the Babala would disguise himself that the, the, the gates might open gates for both of them and they came in. The next thing they went through the, uh, the back door to that um, royal manor and they were doing incantations. Before you know it, this thunder strike now hits. As the thunder strike hits, it can scatter everything where the Oloris, I mean Olori Miriam and her Babala would they do behind that place. Can't carry all of the and throw away, carry in Babala will throw away. They did not get themselves again. That was how Kabi is get to know that Miriam gets somebody when they do something behind Queen Naomi's uh, royal manor. That Miriam arrived into the palace with a Babala to charm Queen Naomi again. For what truly belongs to Queen Naomi, Olori Miriam, she wants to snatch it away from Mommy Tzedenekau. But thank God that the God of, the of Queen Naomi and Kaviyesi are not sleeping. Because nobody would have known what they are doing behind that place. Nobody knew that Olori Miriam, she entered palace with a babalao. Someone that Kaviyesi has told her to leave palace, to pack her properties and leave palace. She is still a sneak around Kabiesi Palace. She still wants to stay and she wants to be the head. She doesn't want to be demoted. And for that reason, she called Babalawo from nowhere. Come enter to come and undo waiting she know behind Queen Naomi Royal Mansion. We don't know whether she won't push Queen Naomi come out. But then we'll say both of them were caught. Yes. Kabiesi caught all, both of them together. And they brought both of them to Kabiesi's chamber. Because Kabiesi talks, say, Miriam go confess what she did do for behind her when Naomi's royal manor. Because Kabiesi already won the Olori, say, but they know they enter that royal manor. But you see Miriam and her Babala behind the royal manor doing what nobody knows. We know that it is incantation, we don't, we don't know the work of what in the, they do for there. But Kabiesi has found out and Kabiesi has called. That all of the media must give confession of what she did do with her babalao behind her when Naomi's royal manor because they must confess before they leave palace now waiting Kabiesi talk. So that Kabiesi will get idea what they they do. My correct and wonderful people. Now the story where we carry on be this. I remember not took my for this matter. Drop your comments, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, stay tuned, stay connected. For more updates, we'll be dropping from time to time about waiting the sub for Inside Palace. And for my returning subscribers, I can never cease to appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you guys so dearly. Thank you so very much for always sticking to Texas TV. I appreciate you all.